Yeah, man, the dissing list continues. We got today Simba, which is replying, is dissing J. Cole because you all saw what J. Cole did. He apologized for his uh, diss track towards uh, uh, Kendrick. Sorry, I couldn't uh, react to that because I was uh, on the road. But nonetheless, we all saw it. Then after this, we got final, finally Drake response towards Kendrick's diss. And then we have another diss track, which is a little surprise. So let's get into it and you'll see it. They say the rap game all fucked up. Numbers is down, the niggas act like bitches, so the girls grew nuts. Niggas cap into the camera. Oh, <laughs> he's starting so, so hard. <laughs> he said, rappers acting like uh, men, acting like, like women, and women, you know, grew nuts, becoming men, right? <laughs> Boss bitch and all of that stuff. You know what I'm talking about. So he's not, he's not, um, he's not wrong for that. <laughs> The niggas act like bitches, so the girls grew nuts. Niggas cap into the camera too much. Go broke it on a podcast and disrespect they man's come up. Y'all boys. Mm -hmm. Facts. When you, you don't have money to make, what you do, you start hating on others that are coming up or are still are, are already there. Yeah, man. Camera too much. Go broke it on a podcast and disrespect they man's come up. Y'all boys worse than dope that's cut. Cause niggas step on everything instead of stepping their priorities up. Yo, baby. Boss. He said, y'all worse than uh, cut drugs. That means, you know, instead of purity, you, 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 you give half of it and combined with some shit practically right so he said you worse than that instead of stepping up your your uh what you said the dope that's cut because niggas step on everything instead of stepping they prior instead of stepping your priorities you know up instead of you know getting your your stuff together in your life you step on on people becoming a hater Boys worse than dope that's cut Cause niggas step on everything Instead of stepping their priorities up Yo baby mama drive a Ford That she can't even afford And now she gotta clean floors For them kids that you ignore we The mother of your child Cause I hate that uh, expression Baby mama um, She's driving a Ford That she cannot afford but uh she does and she has the, the the floors cleaned she has you know before that she can't even afford and now she gotta clean floors for them kids that you ignore for the kids that you ignore so you made made kids with her but she's dating someone else someone else who pays for all her bills that that's something um That is normalizing in US, which that, that's not good, honestly. Or we living in a war where most women is wanting more than what the nigga that they typically end up with can afford. Mm. So niggas going broke. Exactly what I said. Women are uh, uh, dating guys with, with money. That's not good. Buying bottles and renting forms Cause even if she ain't yours She yours is out there yours Even if she doesn't want you Once you Once she sees you have money She's yours She's yours inside that chorus Yeah All they look for is money Hey like Simba drop some music So I guess it's time I've been acting and designing Bitch I'm getting fly I'm two steps ahead of you niggas Who next in line These laundry mad ass rappers Be sounding washed <laughs> they saw they sound washed and dried <laughs> that's 
That's a bar. Ahead of you niggas who next in line. These laundry mad ass rappers be sounding washed and dry. They say I need a song with so and so. I'm not surprised. But every time I send a verse, these niggas petrified. It's time to kill the rap game for a second time. I'm doing drive bys in a Tesla. That's an electric slide. Look. He said. They asked me to 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 do features with you know all these guys, all these rappers, right? But when I send my verse to you know for my part in their feature, they get scared and they don't want me on the track anymore. <laughs> I'm rapping way better than them. And then he said he's doing a drive-by in a Tesla. That's an electric slide. <laughs> Kill the rap game for a second time. I'm doing drive-bys in a Tesla. That's an electric slide. I look the devil dead in his eyes like I ain't scared to die. For damn sure ain't scared to go to war with a friend of mine. Pushing through sunset, lighting up with the top down. Barbershop convos about who sit at the top now. The big three mm. fucked up, cold gave up. <sighs> Hold on. Now we're getting into the big three this. Okay, okay. Damn sure ain't scared to go to war with a friend of mine. Pushing through sunset, lighting up with the top down. Barbershop convos about who sit at the top now. The big three fuck. He said, at the barbershops, uh, people are talking who's at the top right now. Up with the top down barbershop convos about who sit at the top now. Hold on, who sit at the top TDE as well? Kendrick's label. Mm. The big three fucked up. Cole gave up his spot now. Can't say you top five if you scared to be hostile. Ho <laughs> he went straight for it. I mean, he did. He didn't took uh, another route uh, like. Uh, going around it no he went straight for for the kill he said you cannot be you cannot say you are top five in in people's uh uh top five rappers because you are scared to this to be hostile you are scared to to compete practically Facts. Fucked up, Cole gave up his spot now. Can't say you top five if you scared to be hostile. I remember feeling your pain when you let Nas down, but you didn't let Boz down and Kaz down. You didn't let the squad down. What? I felt your pain when you let Nas down. Then. You are done. You let your bars down. Your bar, your bars, rapping. You letting cars down. You let the whole squad down. You done let the squad down. Can't say you the goat if you ain't popping it. We ain't trying to hear all them apologies. Doc exactly. told you niggas that he usually homeboys with who he rhyming with, but this is hip hop, and you niggas should know what time it is. He he just said. Through the truth through bars. I mean, this is why other people are scared for features from him. This is what a, a rap should sound like, especially at this track. Take notes, J. Cole. <laughs> I mean, why would you apologize for? That's crazy. Honestly, it's just. Bro, it's nothing. Um, outside the game you as you said you are friends but still when it comes to the game punch him like Simba said here he's not afraid to to take it on a friend in rap game nothing but uh, competition yeah um, right now we have to get to Drake and his push-ups <laughs> drop and give me 50 <laughs> and I chose the lyrics uh, song just uh, just to, to catch most of the bars right and uh, let's get it okay. Number one fan, your first number one I had to put 
put it in your hand You pussies can't get booked outside America for now I'm out in Tokyo because I'm big in Japan Bro To be honest, I never listened A diss track Or a response from Drake Never thought it is uh, I, I said this before I was never listening to his music that much you know I've listened few of them that were the most popular and I was never considering him a rapper because he was doing all that uh, love songs and stuff right like Kiki and stuff but in this one he went straight for the jugular he went for uh, future right he said I could never be nobody's number one fan because I'm the one who put the number one uh, hit in your hand he's talking about the feature he had with uh, future right and then he said oh you peas can't get booked outside America for nothing right He's talking about uh, Metro Boomin as well. You guys cannot, you're, you're not big, you're just small. Especially comparing to me, because I'm big even in Japan. Hmm. Pan, I'm the hit maker, y'all depend on. Backstage in my city, it was friend zone. You won't never take no chain off of us. How the fuck you be stepping with a size seven man zone? <laughs> Hold on. So he went straight from 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 Metro and, and Future to Kendrick, because he said everything was 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 chill, was friendly in my backstage, right when I was doing shows. But then he said, "How is you big, you big stepping when you're wearing seven as a man? Your shoe size is seven as a man." Kid size. <laughs> you won't never take no chain off of us. How the fuck you be stepping with a size seven man zone? This the part with the bite, nigga. What's up? I know my picture on the wall when y'all cook up extortion, baby. Hope we he said this is the bark with a bite, referring to Kendrick's this about his uh, Drake song with with J Cole. Okay. Nigga, what's up? I know my picture on the wall when y'all cook up. Extortion, baby, hope for red, you been shook up. Cause top told you drop and give me 50 lights of push ups. Mm. Cool, your last one brick. You really not on shit. They make excuses for you cause they hate to see me lit. Extortion, whole career you been shook up. Cause top told you drop and give me 50 like push ups. Because your label told you to, I mean, your label kept you in a leash. At the same time, he's he, he, he did that 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 sound. Huh. Is that a, ref, a reference to Kendrick's sound? If you remember, I was laughing so hard when I first heard him. <laughs> Bro. Yo, last one brick, you really not on shit. They make excuses for you cause they hate to see me lit. Mm. Pull your contract, cause we gotta see the split. The way you doing splits, bitch, your pants might rip. You better do that motherfucking show inside the bitty. Maroon five need a verse, you better make it witty. He said, let's put pull out the receipts, the contracts, and see who's bigger than who. I own my label. You, on the other hand, you split your checks so much that you walk in, you, you don't have money for, for pants even. And then he said he's writing verses for Maroon 5? Really? Do that motherfucking show inside the bitty. Maroon 5 need a verse, you better make it witty. Then we need a verse for the Swifties. Top say drop, you better drop and give them 50. Not only for Maroon 5, but for, for Taylor Swift. So, is that, that, that's her name, right? Taylor Swift? <laughs> Bro, that's... 
Yeah, we need a verse for the Swifties Top say drop, you better drop and give them 50 Pimp squeak, pipe down, you yeah, ain't in no big three Scissor got you wiped down, Travis got you wiped down Savage got you wiped down Like your label, boy, you in a scope right now And you gon' You ain't in the big three You're not in it Scissor got you wiped down Travis caught wiped you down savage 21 savage wiped you down <laughs> to be to be fair i'm not sure if he's that easy to wipe down maybe one of these three did but with numbers with you know when it comes to bars i think kendrick is a bit better than that but that's my opinion so yeah then he said, like the label, you're in the scope. In the scope. Yeah, you get it. Down, savage got you wiped down. Like your label, boy, you in the scope right now. And you gon' feel the aftermath of what I write down. I'm at the aftermath. top of the mountain, so you tight now. Just to add this talk with your ass, I had to hike down. Big difference between I'm a, I'm on the top of the mountain, so you shut up. Just, just to have a talk with you, I have to hike down. I'm so far up, up, uh, higher than you <laughs> that I have to, you know, climb down. Actually, what he said, hike. Okay. So you tight now? Just to add this talk with your ass, I had to hike down. Big difference between Mike then and Mike now. What the fuck is this? A 20 v one nigga? What's a prince to a king? He a son, nigga. It's a big difference between Mike then and Mike now. And I think he refers to Michael Jackson because he was like, beat it, beat it, right? In that video uh, with J. Cole. And then he said, what's a prince to a king? Because Kendrick made that reference. That he's the prince and uh, Drake is uh, Michael Jackson. So he said, what's a prince to a king? You know? I'm your father. You're my son. Shut up. Okay. And then uh, before that, he said, what's this? A 20 versus 1? Like everyone start talking. Like Kendrick had to, to break the ice and then all of a sudden... Everyone is jumping on the on the boat uh, to this Kendrick, uh, to this Drake. Hmm. Yeah, that says a lot. What the fuck is this a 20 v one nigga? What's a prince to a king? He a son nigga. Get more love in a city that you find nigga. Metro, shut your whole ass up and make some drums nigga. <laughs> oh, hold on. So I get, I'm getting more love in your city, the city you are from, than you. So shut up and play with some drums. I think he's referring to Metro because he's the, okay. Yeah, I'm the six guy, I'm the front runner. Y'all nigga manager was Charles Lil Blunt runner. Playing a six and you boys ain't even come from it. And when you boys got rich, you had to run from it. You claiming you're from the, you know, from the six, from the streets, but you, you're not from there. You just claiming you're false, shut up. <laughs> Cash blowing able bread out here tricking. Trickin'? Shit we do for bitches, he doing for niggas. Jets, whips, chains, wicked, wicked, wicked. Spinning like you trying to fuck, boy, you tripping, boy, you tripping. Drizzy chipping there, probably got your bitch in there. I just got him done, boy, don't make me at the chipping there. Rolling loud stage, I would. <laughs> I'm like a chicken there. You know those ripped uh, muscle uh, guys that are, are dancing for, for women? I'll get your your girl, Chanel. <laughs> I just got him done. Ooh. Don't make me have to chip a nail. I got your bitch in nail. I just got him done. Boy, don't make me at the chip and nail. Rolling loud stage. I would turn. That was slick as hell. Shit'll probably change if it be him. Start to kiss and tell. Hugs and kisses, man. Don't tell me about no switches. I'll be rocking every fucking chain I own. Next busy. Hey, I'll be with some bodyguards like Whitney. Top say drop your little midget ass. Better fucking. Hey, <laughs> That's Kendrick again. Drop and give me 50. Drop and give me 50. Niggas really got me out here talking like I'm 50. Niggas really got me out here rapping what I'm living. People 
really got me out here talking like I'm 50. Like I'm 50 years old, like I'm 50 cent. They really got me here rapping what I'm living as 50 cent. Bro. Niggas really got me out here talking like I'm 50. Niggas really got me out here rapping what I'm living. I might take it latest girl a cuff like I'm Ricky. Can't believe he jumping in this nigga turning 50. Every song. Oh, Ricky. He's talking about Ricky Ross? Rick Ross? He took his gut. Ooh, Ooh that's Latest interesting. Latest girl a cuffer like on Ricky. Can't believe he jumping in this nigga turning 50. Every song that made it on a chart, he got from Jizzy. Spend that little check, you gotta stay up out my business, nigga. Ooh. Shout out to the Hooper that be busting out the gritty. We know why you mad, nigga. I ain't even tripping. All that little heartbroken Twitter shit for bitches. This for all the top dogs dropping, give me 50. Drop, drop. In that fucking song, y'all got to not start the beef with us. This shit being brewing in a pot now, I'm heating up. I don't care what cold think that dot shit was weak as fuck. Champagne tripping, he is. Hmm. I don't care what J. Cole thinks about uh, K. Dot's uh, this track. That was weak. Hmm. Champagne tripping, he's not. Now I'm heating up. I don't care what cold think that dot shit was weak as fuck. Champagne tripping, he is not fucking easing up. Nigga calling top to see if top wanna piece it up. Top wanna piece it up. Top wanna piece it up. What? So champagne, he Drake is not dropping. Like he's not easing up. <clears throat> he's tripping. So people calling top TDE to see if they want to piece it up to make peace. Really? Did top uh, the TDE called uh, Drake to make peace? Really? Nigga calling top to see if top wanna piece it up. Top wanna piece it up. Top wanna piece it up. Nah, pussy, now you on your own when you speaking up. You don't roll deep to this, you're not fucking deep enough. Begging cops or not, boy, you not fucking beating us. Numbers wise, I'm out of here, you not fucking creeping up. Hold on. He brought Kai Sinat in this. Bro, <laughs> he's dissing a lot of people right now. You done roll deep to this, is not deep enough. Begging Kai Sinat? Kendrick is begging Kai Sinat for what? Okay. Begging Kai Sinat, boy, you not fucking beating us. Numbers wise, I'm out of here, you not fucking creeping up. Money wise, I'm out of here, you not fucking sneaking up. Corn by your show money, merch money, feed us. I'ma let you niggas work it out because I seen enough. This ain't even everything I know, don't wait the demon up. This ain't even everything I know, don't wait the demon up. Drop and give me 50, all you fuck niggas teaming up. <laughs> so you can't touch me when it comes to numbers you can't touch me when it comes to money i'm wealthier than you i make more sales more more views than you <laughs> you show me money merch money fee money merch money fee to us he called him cornball bro <laughs> oh, that's deep like i'm on another planet than you i'm, I'm so far away <laughs> bro this ain't even everything i know don't wait the demon up drop and give me 50 on your fuck niggas teaming up academic academics said that <laughs> he's smoking <laughs> uh something bad by this and these two okay PG. I thought he said peachy, like a peach. So I made this this uh, this track here. Um, but I wasn't even that hard on it, dude. This this is light work. I was trying to keep it PG, not to curse a lot, not to you know dish you very hard. I just responded to your allegations right 
Now it's your turn, uh, K Dot. Let me see what you got, cause he just said earlier, do not wake up the monster. The hold on, wait, the demon. Sorry, do not wake up the demon. So practically, he's waiting for for Kendrick to say something else, and then he's going hard for the responses. Right, so tell me what you think about this, but before that, we have to get into the surprise I was telling you about. So, yes sir, we got Ricky Rose uh, with his diss track towards Drake, which from what I've heard is just, is dropped just a few hours after Drake's diss, which, you know, that says a lot, depending on how how good this diss track is is gonna tell a lot about Ricky Ross right here. It's called Champagne Moments. <laughs> so let's get it. Fish tanks and marble floors living big and bad. Niggas laugh until they hit with my official jab. Crack smoke is the exhaust from my pen and pad. Ghost writers, they get the floss, what you could have had. Rec Bro. Again, he's talking about Ghost Riders when it comes to, to Drake's music. <clears throat> so, I don't know what is going on. I don't know if that's really, if he really has uh, Ghost Riders, but that's going to stick with him. Your label taking a loss, are you in your bag? You a worker on the chart, don't make me laugh. Get the mind, tell by my watch, this a different time. Living fine, I'm getting high, it's your shit decline. Who I'm a boss, you're, you're just a worker topping charts, don't make me laugh. Oh my god. <laughs> He's really dissing him hard. Because, uh... Drake just said, pull out the contracts and I'll show you who's the boss and who's not, right? And Rick, Rick Ross just said, you know what? Shut up, because you're just a worker. I'm the real boss. Who believes he moving keys in his Louis V's? Run up on you and snatch your chain, watch you bitches bleed. Feel the pain or just describe where you really ride. Either you niggas getting money or ready to die. B.I.G. or give a fuck if you T.I. Lee. You got it and you keep it tough if you be by me. Do the job, better known as the Charles Schwab. Double loss, spread through the yard and I swear to God. Pop a perk for the field, go and count me a meal. Kill you niggas for free, do it all for the thrill. Niggas leaking they records. When we speaking directly, and of course he's talking about Drake. But when he, when did he leak a track? Let me know in the comments. If we keep in the do it all for the thrill, niggas leaking their records. When we speaking directly, if we keep in the gangster, when you see me, you check me. Mm. Let's 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 talk for real. When you see me, check me. Don't talk in in disses. White boy, I see you. I see you. Yeah. Check. Getting bullied, don't walk up on me because the clip is fully. He called him white boy? Or well, he's talking about something else? Because he's, he's light skinned? Wow. <laughs> yeah. Check. Getting bullied, don't walk up on me because the clip is fully. Niggas pussy don't want to push me. I'm like, really, Woody? Like his moves. But he never had a fight in school. Always ran. Another nigga had to write your grooves. Flow was copying your pace. Wheezy gave you the juice. Another white we had to park, want to hang with the crew. No matter how tough you think you are, no matter how dripping you think you are, your juice, your swag is copy and paste from Lil Wayne. Man, <laughs> that that's that's hard. Your <laughs> pace, Weezy gave you the juice. Another white we had to park when they hang with the crew. Pull it surprise when they're switching up like dyed denim. Get incentives for all the killings while we ride rentals. Look me right in my face. He beginning to shake. Told you niggas stay scheming. I predicted my fate. Got more money than you. 
Fuck you want me to say? 50 Ooh. mils for the crib. Where you want me to stay? <laughs> wow. He said he's got more money than Drake. I'm not sure if that's right or not. Because I know Jeezy has a lot of money. But it's probably right if he says so because they as you see in the picture here they went together at some point so he probably got he he knows what he's talking right and then he said 50 million only 50 million for for a house for a crib let me know where you want me to to, to, to stay i'll buy it anyway <laughs> To you, fuck you want me to say 50 mils for the crib. Where you want me to stay? I can shoot up the block, I got bitches to pay. Let you DM my hoes, but got bitches you can't let you. Oh, I, I let you DM my old woman, but I have new women. You can't even touch. You can't afford. You can't. Oh, wow. Oh, oh. I got bitches to pay. Let you DM my hoes. But got bitches you can't. Let you get on my songs. It was good for your face. Now, bitch nigga is home. And no room for debate. <laughs> I also let you be on my tracks. Because it was good for your image. Now you're back home in Canada. And there's no... Uh, we said no songs. It was good for your face. Now, bitch, nigga is home and no room for debate. There's no room for debate. He he thinks he's he's, he's high, is he's, he's big now because he's back home. <laughs> Pop a perk for the field. Go and count me a meal. Kill you niggas for free. Do it all for the thrill. Niggas leaking their records when we speaking directly. If we keeping the gangster, when you see me, you check me. That's what he said. Hold on. You ain't never wanna be a nigga anyway, nigga. That's why you had operation to make your nose smaller than your father knows, nigga. I don't follow you, nigga, cause you sent the motherfucking season to Drake had a nose operation. A nose job. Really? He said, what? Because you didn't want to have your father. Hold on. He called him a white boy. And he did a, a nose job because his nose was too big. His father is black and his mother is white. Probably that's the thing. That's why you had operation to make your nose smaller than your father knows, nigga. I don't follow you, nigga, cause you sent the motherfucking cease and desist to French Montana, nigga. You sent the police, nigga, hating on my dog project. That wasn't the same white boy that I seen, nigga, when we were making them early records, nigga. When you were happy to be around, nigga, seeing nigga so fucking stun in your life, nigga. Get Wheezy some more money, nigga. Bro. He said, Drake sent a cease and desist letter to uh, French Montana. That's his guy, that's uh, Rick's guy. He was hating on the project, bro. And then he said, give Wheezy more money because you tricked him. You paid him way less than he sh you should because you got everything from him. You rap a lot, some more money, nigga. Right, boy? boy? Yeah, what? <laughs> biggest. It's Rose, nigga. We can do it how you want to do it, where you want to do it, anytime you want to do it. I'm Ooh. ready. Ooh. I'm ready, white boy. <laughs> huh? I know you got your dockers on with no underwear, white boy. Yeah, you had that surgery, that six pack going. That's why you wearing that funny shit at your show. You can't hide it, nigga. White boy. <laughs> oh, <my God. laughs> he he says he's disrespecting him a lot, bro. He calls him white boy like five, six times to, to, until this point. He said he has Ghost Riders. He, had, he said he had a, a nose job done to make his nose smaller. But now he says he done another job that he got a six pack. Wow. 
please let me know if you know anything about that if it's true or not <laughs> that's crazy bro <laughs> that's it wow that was some entertainment right there right um that's all I gotta say it's, it's, it's just it's gonna be a long video because it's three in one but there you go let me know your thoughts see you in my next one